Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Hello everyone. This is me, Alia Jeber, from the Palestinian School in Qatar. Today I'm going to explain for grade 5, unit 6, basketball. This is our lesson for today. It is period 2, unit 6, basketball. In this lesson, we're going to answer some questions. The first one, we're going to listen and circle the new words in the text. Then we're going to match words with pictures. And the last thing we are going to do is circle the correct words in the sentences. Ready? Let's start. Now, let's start with the first question. Here, listen and circle the new words in the text. You are going to listen to the text that we have discussed in the previous lesson. Now, I want you to listen carefully to the text and circle the new words in the text. Ready? Let's start. Track 32. Basketball is a fast sport. Boys and girls can play basketball. It is great fun. I like playing basketball. In this photo, I'm younger, shorter and fatter. You need five people to play basketball. Everyone can play this sport. Old, tall, short, thin, heavy and light too. You need to be clever and throw the ball high. You need to be strong and fast. Hey! In this photo, we're first in the basketball games. I'm younger and lighter. This is Dwight Howard. He is American. He is over two meters tall and is 120 kilos. He has wide shoulders and very strong arms. He is clever at playing basketball. He can throw the ball low and high. He's heavier than me. He's stronger than me. He's amazing. Now, let's see the new words you underlined or circled. Let's start. The first one is younger, fatter, lighter, thin, heavy, clever, throw, high, strong, wide, low. Now, let's do question one here. Match pictures with words. First, we're going to read the words, then we're going to match them with pictures. Let's read the words together. Ready? Let's start. Thin, fat, wide, low, young, long, strong, clever, heavy. Light, throw, high. Now, I want you to match the pictures with words. You have two minutes to do this question. Your time starts now. Finish? Good. Now, let's match them together and you can check your answers with me. Number one, thin, with C. The brown cat is thin. Number two, Fat with D. The gray cat is fat. Number three, wide with A. The road is wide. Number four, low. The bed is low. Number five, young. The girl is young. Number six is long. The girl's hair is long. Number seven, strong. 
He is strong. Number eight, clever, is E. He won the game. He is clever. Number nine, heavy, with L. The apple is heavy. Number ten, light, with K. The feather is light. Number 11, throw. He throws the ball. Number 12, high. I can jump high with L. Now you can check your answers. If you have any mistake, you can correct it. I know that you are excellent. You don't have mistakes. Now let's do the last question for today. Read and circle the correct words. Here we have five sentences and for every sentence we have two answers. I want you to read the sentence silently, then circle the correct answer for it. Ready? Start. Finish. Now let's do them together and let's check answers. You can read with me. Let's start with number one. You need 15 or five people to play basketball. If we want to play basketball, how many people do we need? Of course, we need five people. So the correct answer is five. Number two, people with strong or short arms can throw the ball high. If you want to throw the ball high, your arms short or strong? Of course, strong. Three, you throw or jump a ball. If you have a ball, you throw or jump. Throw. The correct answer is throw. Number four, Dwight Howard is heavier or lighter than Ben? What is the correct answer? Heavier or lighter? It is heavier. Number five, in the photo, Ben is fatter or thinner? Ben is fatter. Now you can check your answers. Our lesson for today is finished. I hope it was an easy lesson for you. I hope you enjoyed it. See you soon. Goodbye.